balancing chemical equation so in this video i am going to balance the combustion of propane equation so what is combustion of propane propane c3h8 reacts with oxygen then it gives carbon dioxide and h2o that is water when propane reacts with oxygen it produces carbon dioxide and water what is balancing so the number of atoms on LHS side should be equal to number of atoms of each element on RHS side. Let us draw a table and take elements, number of atoms on LHS side and RHS side. So first, what are the elements here? Carbon, hydrogen and oxygen. We have three elements and number of atoms of carbon on LHS side is three. And on RHS side is 1. And uh, number of hydrogens in LHS side is 8. And number of hydrogens in RHS side is 2. And number of oxygens in LHS side 2. And number of oxygens in RHS side 2 plus 1 3. The number of atoms of each element is different in LHS and RHS. We should make equal so that it satisfies law of conservation of mass as atoms balance then mass also balances so we should make atoms balance now first we try to balance number of carbons so in lhs side number of carbons three in rhs side number of carbons one so if i multiply three here so we should multiply as a coefficient so if i multiply three here the number of carbons become three so if I multiply 3, then it becomes number of carbons in RHS side is 3. But if I multiply here 3, then this 3 is also multiplied with the oxygens. Then oxygens, number of oxygens will also change. So 3 into 2, 6 plus 1. So total number of oxygens on RHS side will become 7. Carbons are balanced. Now try to balance hydrogens. So number of hydrogens on LHS side is 8 and RHS side is 2. So if I multiply 4 here, if I multiply 4 here, then number of hydrogens becomes 8. So multiply 4, multiply 4 on RHS side, then it becomes 8. But if I multiply 4 to this hydrogen, then number of oxygens will also change. So finally, number of oxygens here, 3 into 2 6 plus 4 into 1 4 so total oxygens 10 so it becomes 10 oxygen now finally if i multiply 5 here then oxygens will become 10 so number of atoms in lhs side and rhs side are balanced carbons on lhs side 3 and RHS side 3. Hydrogens on LHS side 8 and RHS side 8 and oxygens on LHS side 10 and 10. So in this way we should balance a chemical equation.